sells for a good 100 to 150 bucks for part or for part slash mostly working. Because this right here okay. sounds amazing, plays great. The cassette doesn't work. I'm seeing about 100 to 150 for parts oh for okay. a cassette dead. Uh, I'm seeing like see. two to three hundred, or about two hundred if it's not that issue. So, and for this kind of price, I can't go wrong. Yeah, for sure. Panasonic, huh? So you're saying the tape doesn't do crap? Yeah. It was the gamble. I it was the gamble. I took it a dollar. But it came with the cord, no cord, right? Oops. It runs on the batteries, right? Yeah. Well, the. Or it can run on either. I thought I had the cord. Hey. Let's see if I can find a cord for it. Oh. The radio works great. Now I see why they sell for so much because they sound pretty darn good. It's a shame because this is the best ghetto blaster I found. I don't normally see the. Yeah, the boom of... boxes, you know, they always bring good money. So, yeah. um, but it's a... all about the condition on them as well, you know. So they're just a pain in the butt to ship too. So, but you probably have a, you probably have a good system of boxes and what do you get adjusted shipping rates too? <laughs> Hope I can get in somehow to the speaker inside. You know, look how dirty this freaking thing is. Oh, Somebody mean, spilled like a coke in it or something. Oh, you mean to clean it out? Yeah. What are you thinking? Take into take into account, uh, take into account my business, uh, because I like I'm a a student and b I have a full time job. So my business is how quick can I turn stuff? Yeah. So if I I, I thought this was like a $200 fine until I found the cassette thing wasn't working as good. So I'm, I'm right. very realistic on what would make you money. But. 25 bucks. Okay, I was thinking about 30 so I'll, I'll do 25 Okay. Look at this, guys. Piano, keyboards. Keyboards everywhere. Ryan just bought us a shed load of keyboards. How many total, Ryan? 12? 12. 12. So we bought from this guy before. It's a little bit of gamble because all of these come without the power supplies, so we can't even, you know, we don't know if they work like this Power's one. Power's on, but I know. Power is on. See, this one is not working. But he already tested those two right there. One Yamaha, one Casio. Both, both of them work. How much you paid? One seventy. One seventy for all twelve. One seventy for all twelve. Now here's the tricky part. If they work great money if they don't basically it's so hard to part them out because you don't know which boards are bad inside uh so they might be just garbage but the yamaha that it's underneath here and over there if they work they're 300 bucks we already know that one works the yamahas go for about three the casios go for about two so it's a gamble but it's a good gamble we already know that we are already making money yeah, and even if the rest of them don't work, you know, I don't know where he gets them probably from some kind of school or auction or who knows where he gets them Look like this pedal is see one of the yeah. keys sticky. So it's a gamble, but it's a good gamble Look at this old Oh my gosh, this has been in somebody's basement for 50 years. Look at this guy. Is that cool or what? damaged here but still pretty collectible I'm gonna be straightforward with you guys 
I don't want to have more than like 150 bucks. If that's cool with you, great. If not, I got to pass. Can we, uh, I don't see here that I can make minus. I mean, minus the file of this thing because I don't. I, I need to do some more research just on that bone. You know, I mean, if minus this, um, and you can have everything else. I mean, even. <laughs> um, I mean, if we meet in the middle, 175, and it's out the door, yours. I want it to. I want it because what me and her have to do. Hey, Ron, we have to do our things. That's kind of why we're here. We needed 200, but we thought we were gonna maybe get more. But after going through your shop, I understand. Because uh, I would like to. I'm gonna be honest. I would like because this thing, I know you can you can do something with it. And then. I can. Huh? I'm, I'm actually almost close to saying passing can you, can you do 175? The reason I was going to give you an offer on that, what's in your uh, hand, I, well, I'm banking on it, that if I give it to my guy, who's going to take it actually to the University of Chicago and had it inspected what it is, you might have something or you might have 10 bucks. Here. Exactly. It's a gamble. Right. And that's why right. this can't be This can't be Okay. <laughs> Keep polishing. I get some footage of that. We got a long way to go. Look how many of them are standing there. Yeah. So far, they ain't clean up the best. This long. Oh, you saw it? Stop <laughs> flipping me off. <laughs> I, I came How long up, can I do this? I said, I came up here and all I'm seeing is your fingers on the monitor. God. I love you guys. They're all been used. I separated them. They all got stickers. They got paper in them. Oh, no, they don't have no sticker. That one has no sticker. Yeah, two of them, three of them had stickers. They wouldn't. But these are like brandy new. They're for the old photo lab stuff. Yeah. If you come here and feel it, you'll see it's porcelain. It'll cut your finger open like anything. It's glass on there. There's broken, dented on this one. They're porcelain. Just like your bathtub. Does it, they don't have any logos on the bottom, right? I don't think I've seen one. I should have taken the box they were in. But it was so stinky and smelly, the box. What do you want for it? I can't find anything I I paid 12 bucks for four of them. I want to make something. Say 20 for all of them. Watch your finger, you'll cut yeah, it. Yeah, yeah. I'm just... Those three are, there's no chips on them. Yeah. Oh, so cute. Oh, you want the big one? There's a big one in the car, he's passing out. Oh. There's sewing machine boxes. I know. Nothing? You didn't find anything? I didn't find anything. Else. What do you want for the uh, receiver, if it works? Hopefully it works. Did you even power it no, out? No, never plugged it in. Okay. All right, what are you going to pay me on this? What are you going to pay me on this? And then I'll tell you what I'm going to pay you on the receiver. I'll give you 20 bucks like All you right. wanted for this. Right. I'll give you 10 bucks like you wanted for this. What do you want on a receiver? Hopefully it powers on. 10 bucks. If it powers on, yeah. you get 10 bucks. So let's bring it in. You can have the speakers. I don't too. want those speakers. They're yeah. Well, they're part of the. They're yeah, from the set. All right. I, don't want them. I didn't want them either, buddy. Kind of made me take them. Sorry. Paid a dollar a piece. I was going to throw them in the that box. So I just picked up these porcelain uh, trays for developing film. These are vintage for sure. Now they don't have a stamp on the back. So they're not Casco, but if you uh, 
if you find Casco ones, they can bring some serious money. Um, I got five of these. Really big one, small one, and three medium ones. Overall in very good condition. Uh, they should probably bring about 70 to 80 bucks. So it's always always good to look out for this kind of stuff because they're hard to find actually, but when you find them, they'll bring good money. What do you want for this? I'd like to make some profit, but not much. Which is? Would you do 10 bucks? Not gonna argue. Okay, you might have paid more. I have to. I, I'm much more of a snake when it comes to like people I only do one-time business with. Like meaning, I'll try to guzzle you for the most, but I want to build a relationship here. So. I like that. I try to guzzle you for the most.